Hey guys, it's me, the Honda Wolf 12 here, and today we're going to be doing another inflatable unboxing, inflation, and review video. And today it will be of the Airblown Pumpkin Reaper with Top Hat. This is the one that was sold at Home Depot in 2020, but the year after, J. Marcus picked it up and started wholesaling it to other places. And that is actually where this came from. It came from uh, Line 9 Sales, which is J. Marcus's vendor name on Amazon. Um, and they were running a sale for some things that were 40% off, some things were 30% off, some things were 20% off. This was one of the 40% off things. So the original price they wanted was $70, but I got this for $41, which is really good for a 12-foot inflatable. I've wanted a 12-foot inflatable for a while. Uh, just never worked out, but finally got this one for a good price. So I'm excited to use it this year. And as you can see, I already cut the tape and inside we get the normal, usual stuff. The bag of stakes and tethers, instructions, and of course the inflatable itself. Now, since this is 12 foot, obviously I won't be able to inflate it in my room. So I will take it out back and plug it in out there. I'll also try to do a time lapse on this because I know other people do that. And I think it does make the video more enjoyable. So we're gonna try that. I'll be back. All right, so here he is. And as you can see, he's very, very tall, very imposing. I've always wanted a Halloween inflatable this size or bigger. So I'm happy with him and I'm really happy with the design. It's a great design and I'm happy to own it. The LED eyes also look really great. Um, the camera's not picking it up very well because it's still kind of daylight. The sun hasn't set yet, but he does have, uh, let's see, 67s, so that's good. He lights it pretty good. The middle of the body doesn't, but his lower half has two, each hand has two, either one in the head and then one in the hat. So those parts all light up very nicely. And like I said, the eyes look really great too. Um, I don't really have a whole lot to say about it other than I'm really happy with it. It looks great and I'm excited to use it in the display. So anyway, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.